major divisions and part of the nervous system. But before that, let us first talk about nervous system and its function. Our nervous system connects all our body parts and transmits signals from one part to another. It is a system of cells, tissues, and organs that regulates the body's responses to internal and external stimuli. Each part of the nervous system has a specific role as it functions as an important part of a system. The nervous system have two major divisions. The central nervous system or CNS and the peripheral nervous system PNS. First major division, the central nervous system. It serves as the main processing center for the entire nervous system. And the CNS consists of two main components, namely brain and spinal cord. First main component of CNS, the brain. This is an organ located within the skull that functions as organizer and distributor of information for the body. And brain has three main parts, cerebrum, cerebellum, and brainstem. Cerebrum, a large upper part of the brain that controls activity and thought. Cerebellum, the part under the cerebrum that controls posture, balance, and coordination. Brainstem, the part that connects the brain to the spinal cord and controls automatic functions such as breathing, digestion, heart rate, and blood pressure. The second main component of CNS, the spinal cord. Spinal cord serves as a channel for signals between the brain and the rest of the body and controls simple musculoskeletal reflexes without input from the brain. The second major division of nervous system, the peripheral nervous system or PNS. The function of peripheral nervous system is to connect the central nervous system to the organs and limbs. Just like central nervous system, the peripheral nervous system also has two main divisions, the somatic nervous system and the autonomic nervous system. The somatic nervous system is associated with the voluntary control of body movement, like blinking of the eye. The somatic nervous system is associated and it has two main parts, namely the spinal nerves and the cranial nerves. Spinal nerves, the nerves that carry motor and sensory signals between the spinal cord and the body. Cranial nerve, the nerve fibers that carry information into and out of the brain stem. The second main division of PNS. This system is associated with the involuntary control of body movement and it has two subdivisions, sympathetic and parasympathetic. Sympathetic, it is activated when the body is in a dynamic role or stress. Parasympathetic, it maintains body functions and restores the body to normal or relaxed mode. So, this is the simple representation for you to understand what are the major divisions and parts of the nervous system. So again, we have two major divisions for nervous system which are the central nervous system and the peripheral nervous system. Central nervous system consists of two main components, spinal cord and brain. And brain consists of three, three main parts which are the cerebrum, cerebellum, and spinal cord. Next, let's go to the peripheral nervous system. It, 
it is also has two main division somatic nervous system and autonomic nervous system somatic nervous system consists of two main parts the spinal nerves and cranial nerves likewise to autonomic nervous system it also has two subdivisions the sympathetic and parasympathetic thank you for watching please like and subscribe rica mabelas bus for more upcoming educational videos god bless you all